Welcome back. This is another SolidWorks Tutorials with Ryan. And in this very episode, I'm going to cover how to join two parts in SolidWorks for beginners. Let's get started. So I have two parts here. Basically, it was it used to be one part. I cut it in half, split it, and I will cover that how to split it apart in a different video. But now we have these two parts separated from each other. Sometimes you have the parts already connected to each other. The concept is the same, okay? So, there are some rules before you can join two parts together. First of all, you cannot connect these two parts together because there is a distance between them. They have to be connected. And by connected, I don't mean uh, connected by a corner, a point. Or a line because those two connections don't work the connection needs to be at least a surface on surface or a volume a, in an interacting volume then you can combine or join these two parts together okay so if you have a cylinder laying down on top of a block a surface the connection between the cylinder and the surface will be a line you cannot connect or join these two parts together okay so first I need to connect these two parts together for that there is a feature called move copy bodies I have added that into my menu but if you don't have it you can always you can always go to insert features and then you will find it here move copy okay so let me drag this all right so I'm gonna uncheck copy because I don't need a copy and I'm gonna click on constraints. So I'm gonna pick the red part, put it on the green part. My constraints are, let's just say, I want this surface to sit on this surface. Okay, again, and I want this surface to sit on this surface. Now. These two parts are sitting on each other, but they're not joined. There are still two different bodies. You can see it in this folder. Solid bodies, two. How to join them? And there is another feature called combine. Okay, again, I have added combine here. I will tell you how in a different video, but you can find it here in insert, features, combine. So combine offers you three operation types. Add, subtract, subtract, common. So what you want to do, assuming if you looked for this video, you want to add them together. You don't want to subtract these parts from each other or you don't want the common volume uh, trapped between these two parts. So I check add, click on them both and click OK. There you go. Now you have one body and you have successfully joined these two parts together. I hope you liked this video. It was a very short one, but hey, it was effective. Like and share. No. Just like and subscribe if you think it was quick and efficient. See you next time in the next video.